Air launch startup Avum on December 3 unveiled Raven X, the drone aircraft that will serve as the first stage of its smallsat launch system. Avum, a four-year-old company based in Huntsville, Alabama, is positioning Raven X to compete in the increasingly crowded small launch market, promising fast response service enabled by an autonomous aircraft that can take off from any mile-long runway. The 55,000-pound unpiloted aircraft is 80 feet long with a 60-foot wingspan. While in flight it will release a two-stage rocket that can launch 100 kg to 500 kg of payload to low orbits. Raven X will be ready for operations within the next 18 months after it clears regulatory hurdles. The next step will be to seek airworthiness certification for the drone from the Federal Aviation Administration. The vehicle later will go to Cecil Spaceport in Jacksonville, Florida, for orbital launch testing. Getting through the regulatory challenges to fly an unmanned air vehicle that launches rockets will be tough. The goal is to provide reliable service with minimal logistics footprint. The vehicle uses jet fuel and the same equipment as airplanes. The aircraft's long and lean shape was designed for speed, autonomy and software-driven processes will help shorten the lead time of launches from years to months. U.S. leadership has identified the critical need for extremely fast access to low Earth orbit. The company has not disclosed how much private funding it has raised. Some revenues already are being generated from government contracts. Raven X's first launch will be a U.S. Space Force mission called Agile Small Launch Operational Normalizer, or ASLON-45. The $4.9 million contract the company got in September 2019 had been originally awarded to Vector Launch but Vector withdrew in the wake of financial difficulties so the job was reassigned to Avon. The mission will fly from Cecil Spaceport. Avum is one of eight companies the Space Force selected to compete for launch contracts in the Orbital Services Program 4, a $986 million procurement of launch services over nine years. In addition, the company has received a small business innovation research contract from the U.S. Air Force and a classified Pentagon contract. The goal long term is to have about 85% of Avum's business come from commercial customers, and 15% from defense and research agencies. The business plan is based on conducting about 8 to 10 launches a year at prices ranging from $5 million to $7 million a launch.